Okay, so in order to bring some clarity to copying notes forward with the integrated application of DAX Copilot, uh, this is uh, essentially what I was trying to convey. So we know that if we uh, touch the DAX Copilot items after uh, prior to uh, dictating in them, that they lose their functionality to populate the text that we dictate. Uh, however, there is a potential workaround should that occur. Uh, so here's a sample note. I'm going to go ahead and copy it forward immediately. Now, to my understanding, uh, is that I can actually uh, manipulate this prior to dictating within this daily um, such that or, or within this encounter um, such that it will not lose its functionality and if it does then the ultimatum would just simply be to uh, delete it completely and then just repopulate it because it just breaks the link temporarily for the smart section that is it there so you can see that i've manipulated it simply uh, by deleting the period uh, then I'll go ahead and just test it. Um, so I'll go ahead and uh, dictate into this note and we'll see how it populates or not. So the assessment and plan for today's session, we've worked on shoulder external rotation and internal rotation. We used progressive incremental resistance uh, for the rotator cuff uh, using isometric uh, loading and resistance at end ranges of motion in both directions. We also incorporated slow controlled tempo eccentrics. Uh, there was a formal review of the posterior cuff and rib cage mobility exercises that were previously described. Future sessions will uh, incrementally progress with higher percentages of MVIC exercises targeting the rotator cuff muscles as well as the periscapular muscles to enhance the shoulder complex stability. Um, the interventions provided were intended to improve the patient's condition by addressing protected healing tissues, capacity, and abide by uh, the post-operative precautions whilst incremental, incrementally progressively inducing tissue extensibility, tolerance to stretch, and improve the arthrokinematics and physiology of the glenohumeral joint as well as the scapular the thoracic joint. Uh, the patient will follow up next week um, in the first week of February. Uh, it is going to be February 6th that I'll see her next. Okay. And then so this kind of proves out what I was describing is even though I manipulated the text prior to actually dictating it's still populated and so that that would suffice as to i before i dictate anything into the new note i can go back delete the previous uh, information within that smart section and touch it and manipulate it however i want to uh, as long as i haven't dictated within this new note because it doesn't break the link and then I can go ahead and just start to populate and dictate for this encounter. And it doesn't break the functionality. Now, that being said, I gave the example also uh, uh, in, the, in the meeting that say I go in and by happenstance, I, I do change something. So again, just deleting a single character, um, the simplest of edits. And then that would break the link. Right, so then if I was to dictate more, uh, then that then it wouldn't actually continue to populate. Uh, I'm going to spare us the uh, the time to give that example, but we all know that once it's been touched and manipulated after text has already been dictated within this encounter, that it won't populate. So if I want to dictate more, uh, and I say I did that by accident, perhaps. Uh, then the next step would simply be to copy what sections I want to or information is necessary, but I could simply just delete this and then repopulate it. And it will, it will only populate the information from this uh, encounter. Uh, so that would, and so it wouldn't, it, it would reestablish the links with DAX Copilot. Uh, for instance, we'll, we'll do one example uh, now just to ensure that the link is still there. 
Additionally, future sessions will actually evaluate the opposite shoulder as well as the cervical spine of this patient, as she's also been complaining of neck pain, persistent, particularly early in the morning and with sustained postures uh, with the opposite shoulder. Uh, additionally, uh, she's been having incremental symptoms at shoulder level and above, particularly when pushing and pulling uh, uh, weights that are 10 pounds or more. And then it regenerates and you can see that it turns green again. Thus, we've reestablished uh, the connection and you can see that that information has populated at the end of my assessment. Uh, so to summarize, you can copy it forward. If you haven't dictated anything into the note and you haven't pre-phrased uh, anything, you can manipulate, i.e. delete the previous notes information and the link holds. It only is broken once you copy forward initiate your dictation, and then manipulate it. Uh, and then, for instance, if you, uh, the, senkel, the second uh, bit is like, if the link is broken, not is all lost, you can, si you can simply delete that section. Feel free to copy and paste, again, the information that you want from that section, and then just reestablish it by repopulating the link. I hope that helps. Uh, that's what I was trying to convey with the, the two options for troubleshooting. Um, but again, uh, there was also the recommendation that you could copy for just the, uh, the text as well. Um, and that, that's also an option. This is my workflow. Just wanted to share.